Nah, I'm good. I love this, bro. I love this. Shit. Rimuru, talk your shit, bro. You don't need him. Look her review. Today, we're checking out the season finale for that time I got reincarnated as a slime. But first, if you enjoyed the video, click the like button, maybe subscribe to the channel, and you can find the full link as well as exclusives over on Patreon, plus other links in the description if you're interested in checking out some content that's not the anime reactions. I do other stuff, other places. Maybe stop by the live stream so you can hang out with me and the rest of the community as we watch anime, like ReZero next season on Wednesdays. I'll be watching that, so stop by for those streams. Stop by for any of the other ones. All right, let's watch the episode. Kingdom of Gaston, Duke Muse. I don't like him. I don't fucking like him, but I do like his little thing, his little trinket here. That looks kind of hard. I like this. This this part's cool. I like this. <laughs> nah, I'm good. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> Bacana! <laughs> well, how dare you imply that we have fake money? Damn. Got them uh, appraising it. Oh my god, what a surprise! They're real dwarven gold coins. That is so disrespectful to Rimuru. This is a bigger disrespect to him that you guys believed he could not have real currency to pay you. We're saying we'll trust you as long as you pay us. No, but you didn't trust me before. So I'm not going to trust you. Or something. I don't know. What is he saying? Yeah, literally. That, yeah, literally. You couldn't trust us, so I don't give a fuck about you guys anymore. You came in here with your biases. You didn't trust me. I've now won your trust, but fuck it. I don't need you anymore. You know how many merchants there are in this world? Why does he have to fuck with y'all? Get wrecked. Damn, get fucked. All of you. Such tyranny will not be overlooked. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. That's the way that you should. You were supposed to get on his good side, and now you're calling him a, a tyrant. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dang. Nah, I'm good. I love this, bro. I love this shit, Rimuru. Talk your shit, bro. You don't need them. Stand on business. Stand on it. Matter of fact, stand on business, Rimuru. And merchants, get fucked. Yes, good, good, good. That look that Diablo gave. Ugh. Oh shit, we actually are getting back to the meetings and shit. Oh, what is this? Ooh. Ah. It's better to kindly get them in your debt than to frighten them. Okay. Oh. Oh, he's trying to draw out the real scumbag behind it all. New technology, bro. Bro, I'm holding copyrights to everything. I'm getting mad money. I'm, I'm finding a way to copyright things, enforce law, something, something, make money. In fact, fuck that. Don't even share it with them. Keep it all for yourself. Be the greatest technologically advanced country there is. Ooh. Benny. Benny's got to be the one in, in charge of construction. That way he got to come through. Spend time with his boo. Nah, I don't know shit about construction. You better learn, bro. We got to get that tunnel, bro. We need to, we need you to put your train in her tunnel. Wait, 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 wait. Don't be weird. I mean that we're going to make the tunnel so that way the train can go through. Don't be weird, chat. I'm not saying anything weird. 
My wife. My wife. Ooh, I like that term. The co-human monster prosperity sphere? Is that what she said? Something like that? A human and monster co-prosperity sphere. Okay, this, that's cool. I like that. Ooh. What crops? What kind, what kind of crops are they doing? Mm. Good, good. The magic train that revolutionizes the distribution of girds. Of goods. If you build its hub in our kingdom of Blue Moon, oh. Cool. Wait, 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 wait. But if it's all going through them as a hub, he's gotta, they gotta be able to tax this shit and make some money, right? Everything's about money. They would love some prize money. Mm. And you offer this big amount of money, right? But by the time somebody actually does win and defeat Veldora, if that ever does happen, to secure that amount of money, you probably have way more than that amount of money just from the people buying the supplies, entering in the dungeon, whatever. So it pays for itself. Wait, Yuki is in on this? This motherfucker's here? I didn't even know Yuki was here, bro. I didn't even, I didn't even pay attention. He was shown earlier? Yeah, but I didn't pay attention. I didn't even I didn't even think to think of him. <laughs> Slap a guild shot in there, right? <laughs> Wait, so we're stealing Bro, that's crazy. So we are stealing jobs from the Adventurer's Guild, and he's just gonna be okay with that? Not really stealing, more like stopping them from existing. Oh, it, it's so true. The jobs don't exist anymore because he's now in charge of the Jora Forest, so now people don't need to go into the, uh, the forest to defeat monsters and shit. Cause he'll be able to be like, nah, forest, we're not doing bad stuff anymore. Wow. Okay. 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 True. 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 Wow. There's so many, and this is one thing I love about slime. Just so many things you don't even think about, or at least I don't even think about. It's so detailed. There's so much interesting shit for the world building and the politics of it all. It's so interesting. I really do love this show. I do. We're perfecting the secret of faith and grace as well. Oh. Whoa! That's so funny. That's so that's so goofy. He got, this motherfucker is literally Veldora. And the thing he's embarrassed about is cooking yakisoba. It's so goofy. She just called him out on the fact that he cooks yakisoba. And he's like, no, that's not me. I don't cook yakisoba. That's so stupid. But it's silly. It's not stupid, but it's silly. That's wild. Yeah, I would be so, I would hate to be one of those holy knights or whatever. Like, okay, so you're saying that in order to conquer, I have to defeat him, Veldora, the storm dragon. The dude that, like, single-handedly was, like, controlling this forest. Okay, yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, no, no, that sounds like a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. While locked up. He was literally keeping the, the, the forest in check while locked up. 
Yeah, I'm saying, bro. Fuck. Yeah, we'll slap you in the fucking dungeon, bro. Yeah, this man fucked up, huh? Damn. Wrecked. As expected. Damn, little girl. Yeah, wasn't she there? She was literally there. You thought it would be a shame to destroy that country. What? Yo, and Hakuro probably noticed her, bro. There's no way. He literally serving her, bro. That's the GOAT. She was there the whole time? Wow! Who would have seen that coming? I never noticed her not once. Wow! I definitely did not see her every time she was there. They should have put her more in the background if they wanted us not to see her. I am greed. What is this echidna wannabe? Bro, I love the zoom in on the eyes. That's like literally to show us. This man knows what's up, Yuki. He knows. Bro, I hope Yuki's sweating right now, bro. I hope Yuki's sweating. Yo, season three is about to be lit, right? For sure. I'm so excited for season three. That's so crazy that they're like, they got the dra- oh, That's so insane. Yo, they're staying in Tempest? Let's go! And I feel like Masayuki definitely switching sides, right? I can't see him siding with Yuki over Rimuru. Damn, dude. Oh, good episode. Very enjoyable. In fact, I'd probably give it as high as like an 8.7. Let me know what you all thought about this one down in the comments.